Howdy folks, it's Sunday, April 25, 2021. Um, I've been, I wrote on Sunday about the back banding and uh, this is all the material that I've cut for that back banding. And um, so every one of these boards that I have cut is five eighths inches wide and seven eighths inches thick. And that will, when it's cut to final shape, fit over the edge of the MDF. You can see that nice and tight. Um, so that's how that's gonna work. So, I set this up, this is the board I'm cutting. And what I did is I put another board on with my clamps to hold it, hold this one down. This pushes it in against the fence, the workpiece, and this pushes it in against the fence when it's, after it's been cut. After it's been cut, what I'll do is uh, you see this, the wider part will get uh, cut off and I'll be running these through upright in the, with, against the fence. So uh, it's been a very time consuming task to say the least, but uh, I'm about maybe 20% of the way through it, uh, as far as making these blanks. I make them from the cutoffs when I, uh, there's my, what'll be my uh, baseboards. This will be the back banding for windows. This is the back banding for door tops. Those four, Right there are back banding for door frames. There's the door frames. Uh, so once I, you know, you, you take the biggest piece out of a, a board and you know, my boards are over here. Um, these are ones right here in these two piles that I've cut that are rough cut. Um, this is my hard maple. And so for instance, if I was cutting on this board, which goes from here to there, um, five and a half inches, which is what my baseboards are, it's gonna leave some amount of this board left over. And if it's one and three eighths, I'll use it as a back band for doors or windows. If it's less than that, what I'll do is I'll use it as back band for my um, MDF wainscoting. I need 53 uh, one by sixes for my baseboards um, and eventually they'll get planed down and routed. And I have right now 15 and six is 21 and 10 is 31. So I need 22 more and I'll probably be taking it out of this pile and this pile and maybe that. Uh, and then again, whatever's left on a board, it gets cut for back bands for windows or doors or ultimately back bands for the MDF and those are pieces that would normally probably get thrown away, the MDF, because what I'm ultimately after is a 5 8 inch wide piece that I cut. Uh, these will be door tops right here. This is the windows, windows. These are some cutoffs that um, I will use to make spindles for the, for around the, the staircase. So, I've got a lot going right now. Uh, 
Sunday is Saturdays and Sundays are my days to plane. <coughs> that thing makes a god awful noise. Um, the dogs howl, and the reason I can do it Saturdays and Sundays is Erin's not here because she works from our house for her job for U.S. Bank. So, uh, you know, it's a lot of work, but uh, I have a lot of pride for what it looks like when we get done. Thanks for following our progress. I'll show you the upstairs here in the next day or two.